This video will review how to weight grades in Canvas. To begin, I'm logged in as an instructor and I'm going to use my left hand navigation menu to go to grades. This will take me to the grade book for instructors in Canvas. You'll notice on the left, here are all of my students listed, their secondary IDs, which in this case are their emails, and at the top we'll see a list of all the assignments that they've been assigned for this course. I can scroll down at the bottom and you can see the assignments continue. To weight grades in Canvas, you weight them by assignment group. Click on this downward arrow and you'll see you have a number of options in our grade book center. You can view grading history, you can download the scores as a .csv file, you can upload scores as a .csv file, you can set group weights, which is what we're going to do, hide students, arrange columns by due dates, treat ungraded as zeros, which is very helpful at the end of a semester, and show concluded enrollments, so show students who um, have finished the course. So we're going to go to set group weights. I want to weight my final grade based on groups. And here are the groups that I have uh, pre-designed when I was creating assignments in this course. So I want to make my library column 20%, assignments 40. I have a running total at the bottom that lets me know I have 40% left to add. Tests are going to be 20%, discussions 10, and this total column 10, adding up to 100%. I click Save, and now all of my grades will come up to a percent total that will be found here at the end, and this is represented of my weight total. These are percent columns that are going to pull to this final total. If you have any questions about grading in Canvas or using weighted grades, please be sure to contact the Digital Education Collaborative.